What's going on guys, it's your boy Gerald back on the inside with another edition of Men's Fragrance and Fashion Extra. Today we are discussing this fragrance here, Fragrance World Mocha Wood, right? I don't see this fragrance getting like hype, I don't see much reviews. There are reviews on it but it's not one of those fragrances that you know always in every top 10 list and so on, right? So I wanted to give this fragrance a fair chance right so we're gonna dive into this and i'll be giving you my take on this letting you know if it's something we'll pick it up or not all right it's not gonna be a long video but of course we have to get the intro out of the way so <laughs> if this is your first time tuning into this channel my name is jerriel and on this channel we discuss everything fragrance related so if you enjoy content like that do me a favor and hit that subscribe button don't forget to click the bell so you'll be notified every time i put out a new video which is weekly at this point so just sit back relax see if this is something you'll be interested in but i really appreciate you being here today and for those who are custom tuning in big up yourself one time and drop a like on the video of course it helps the algorithm so with that out of the way let's get right into this fragrance so fragrance world mocha wood what is this fragrance this fragrance is basically a banging chippy a banging chippy that's what i'll say all right well let's get into like some of the notes and so on so of course fragrance will it's a, a dope house from i believe they're from the middle east but yes fragrance will they produce some really nice clones um i don't think they are as popular as the armaffs and the um the al haramins and, and latafas and so on but they they are no slouch so don't sleep on them all right in terms of the notes in this fragrance here yeah, again this well before the notes the profile of this fragrance is a uh, amber spicy coffee fragrance all right so with that being said some of the notes in this would be you have hazelnut you have saffron rhubarb ylang ylang that's the top in the heart we have sandalwood tobacco tonka bean patchouli rose and in the base we have benzoin wood fur cypriol and gayak wood so what i'll say about this is that in this fragrance it's almost like you can detect a lot of the notes that i've just called out there so you get a little bit of the saffron you get a little bit of the rhubarb the lang lang of course well the coffee is the main note here and um, you get the woods you get the benzoin you get that ambery sweet vibe coming from this fragrance now before i continue let me just say i really enjoy this fragrance like I'm being honest with you. Why? Because <laughs> there's a particular fragrance from Tiziana Terenzi called Deluxe. Love that fragrance. Just don't have a bottle yet, but keep me in your prayers, guys. I need to get a bottle of that soon. And I love that fragrance. It's similar to Intense Cafe from Montal. Right? So if you like any of those types of fragrances, this one is along the same lines. It's very similar actually. Um, so again, you get that coffee they get that hazelnut um nutty vibe it's very cozy i don't know how they did this for the price category this sits in if i'm being honest this doesn't smell nothing like the price tag like nothing like the price tag it actually smells like a niche fragrance right like like seriously it smells like a niche fragrance that's how how good it is just don't know how they did it right i don't even get much of that synthetic um vibe coming out from this because it's so you see the color of this juice love it even the presentation is like what's going on here how y'all did this for the price category anyway i digress so again you get a lot of these warm spicy notes coming out here but again if you're if you're into the coffee this is one for you if you don't really like you know those coffee style fragrances you're probably not going to enjoy this right i even get like a a, a kind of tarty rose coming out of this fragrance as well i get a rose i'm not sure was that listed i know i get a rose I look, yeah yeah right so the rose is dominant here just like in the intense cafe and the deluxe you're gonna get that rose vibe here the rose is heavy here all right is it more noticeable than the coffee i'll say probably yeah you get the rose especially in the opening you get the rose there but that coffee is all out through this fragrance as well so it's a combination of both and then well those warm spicy notes that go along with it it's really really good must say it's really good in terms of uh, how it performs it's it's not weak by no means but it's not a beast mode but i think if you go heavy on the trigger uh, which i did it lasts me for a, a good couple hours probably about eight hours so it has the potential to to provide you with really good longevity and um the cr is nice as well um it's not a room filler but somebody who comes with in your space they're going to get a little whiff of this fragrance so the performance is you know just above average i would say and that's really really good so um again price tag 
on the cheaper side occasions this is one definitely for cooler weather so over here of course we here in the, in the tropics more evening time night time all those situations there on the evenings and tonight is going to work really well of course you can wait in the day if you want to uh, you're probably in an air conditioned environment you could wear it of course but again it's more on the sweeter side so just be careful you don't want to you know cause any problems anywhere so it's not a fresh fragrance so just get that out of your mind one time i'd say you could even wear this dressed up right so you're putting on a little blazer a little shirt underneath yeah you could do that there with this one as well but for me it's more on the hanging out casual side kind of vibe but again it could work in either all right so that's more or less it that's more or less for this fragrance again as you could hear from how i'm speaking about it it's something i really enjoy and again because i like the other two fragrances that i mentioned there so if you you know like fragrance along those lines this is definitely one you could check out definitely get a you don't even get a sample because it's so affordable you could just probably buy the bottle um and if you know some others who probably like this day as well you can get a little some few little decans sprayed off of them and you know pass it around right but i had to do a review on this fragrance because it's something again that i think people sleep on but it's very good so big up the fragrance will for this one um putting it out there this this one needs some love this one needs some love all right so check it out guys check it out all right so i hope it was helpful in some way again I don't want it to be too long so yeah if you have this one let me know in the comments your take on it and of course i will get back to you there if you like this video drop a like and yeah of course i'm always grateful for you taking the time to to watch these videos all right much appreciated thank you very much so guys you know we do it here stay fresh smell the best and i will definitely catch you guys in the next video so until then i'm out peace